Hey guys, how is it going? Welcome back to another video. All right guys, so this video is day number 182 in our new account series. And uh, without wasting any time, let's begin. And now I have played a lot uh, in about Champions Arena, Solo Raids plus Arena. So yeah, you know, this will be a fun video because you will see a lot of progress than what you've seen in the previous video. So the first thing, the first important thing that I have finally reached level 60. Uh, the total account level is finally level 60 as you can see over here uh, and my roster threat uh, is 5.3 million which is uh, I guess decent you know considering this is a free-to-play account and I've done that in like six months all right guys so before we proceed further uh, you know I just wanted to let you know that if you are new to the channel and if you're watching this video for the first time I would like to ask you to please hit the subscribe button and click on the bell notification for further updates on videos just like this all right, guys, as usual, let's start off with Arena. So we may not have a lot, uh, any Arena medals to spend today. But the good thing is that I am on Invincible with 27 million points. And I think with another 10 million points, I should be on 37 million points, uh, which means that I have a very high chance for reaching the legendary spot. So at this particular moment, I'm on rank number 83 with 39 victories. And uh, I'm going to take Justice League Aquaman to five stars right after this arena season ends. But yeah, you know, so uh, the guy who is on rank under rank 50, you know, let's take a look at that person. All right. So I may not be able to. OK, yeah, I, I think I just might, you know, because he's having 33 million points and I could get around 12, 10, 12 million points after this uh, refresh. And uh, I could get somewhere around over here, which is, I think, enough for me to, uh, you know, I have to be under rank 50 if I want to stay on legendary spot. So that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to try to get myself under rank 50. All right, guys, now let's move on into solo raids. There we are, solo raids. Okay, so I have finally finished off boss Superman and I've also uploaded the fight. And I have started fighting uh, sub bosses over here on. Uh, tier 5 i did have one pip play i do have i think the loa pip still left to play with so that's what i'm going to play over here uh, maybe i'll use it on uh, dr fate you know maybe uh, because swamp thing is immune to dot so there is no point in using the loa team on swamp thing because loa teams most of the damage is done through dot or maybe i'll use it over here you know maybe i'll use it on black canary all right, guys. So, and then after that, Boss Green Arrow uh, should not be that big of a deal as well. I think maybe I can also use it on Boss Green Arrow. All right, guys. So, so far, uh, Solo Raid is going great. We still got three days, which is more than enough, I think, for me to finish off these sub bosses, plus finishing off Zatanna. And Zatanna is not that big of a deal. She's not that difficult to defeat. So, yeah, guys, you know, wish me luck and let's hope that I finish off Zatanna as quickly as possible and move on to heroic 2 so this probably will be the first solo raid uh, where i'll reach uh, heroic 2 you know on my new account on my beta voids account all right guys let's move on in champions arena i did play a hell lot of fights in champions arena you can see i was on zero points yesterday and i'm on 96 points today so altogether, it's 13 fights that I've played and I've won each and every one of them, which is a great thing. And uh, yeah, you know what? I think uh, if I get another 100 points or 90 points today, yeah, this gets me to 200 points and then another 100 points tomorrow after that will get me to 300 points, which is, I think, more than enough for me to stay on, uh, I'm sorry, to promote to division number three. And then we'll see how things go over there, uh, you know, if I am having enough time or if I'm able to fight a lot of fights in Champions Arena, then we'll decide if you want to go over uh, Division 3 and reach Division 2. But there is one thing that I can say today is that I'm most definitely going to grind enough to get myself back to Division number 3. And then after that, we'll see what happens over there. All right, guys, so it's going to be 1200 gems and 50 might shards. That's what we're going to get, you know. And getting 50 might shards, I'll probably use them on multiverse armor with Supergirl because I'm looking forward to upgrading that character. And that's where I'm going to use it. All right, guys, let's move on. Uh, let's move on into the store. 
all right guys we have a couple of chests over here which are new the artifact material pro chest was already there yesterday we got girl of seal super girl a decent uh, a decent support actually more than decent support character if you have her at four stars or above at three stars she might not be that good you know i did a chest opening for her i have uploaded already on my channel you guys can watch it this it was a previous video uh, before this one and then we got the justice league team chest now i'm thinking about opening this chest on my lord lucifer's account you know i have like seven eight thousand gems over there as well you know and the reason why i'm doing that uh, is because i think uh, it's time now to get justice league cyborg on that account you know it, either it's going to be justice league cyborg that i'm going to go for or i think it, it might maybe i'll just go for someone like deathstroke or you know batman who loves you know but yeah, you know, it would be great to have Justice League Cyborg, you know, so I think uh, 2.8, 2.8, 2.1, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5. That gives us around 14, I think 14 or 15 percent uh, chances for getting one of these characters. It could be anyone. I could get uh, Justice League Batman. I could get uh, Justice League Superman too, which I'm not planning to buy or unlock. It's no guarantee that I might end up getting Justice League Cyborg. So it will be a gamble. That's for sure. But let's see. All right, guys. Now, finally, let's jump into the roster. I think I might have some resources that I've already used up. Let's see. Yeah, I did actually took uh, Black Manta's sword to f level 40. I do have some rerolls, which I'm going to use over here. All right. Critical attack damage is something that I don't need right now. Come on. So I have a hundred rerolls almost. I may spend like 15, 20 today uh, trying to get the right effect. Oh, come on, man. Attack is, I could have picked it up, but it's a common attack. You know, a rare attack would have been much better. Come on. Ah, C A D and lethal attack. Okay, come on, guys. What's up with all these common effects? I think there is no uh, rare effects left. Okay, there is critical attack chance. It's still better than this one. Okay, those are all rare attacks, which is great. All right, let's reroll this one. I've already got one critical attack chance. Come on, dude. What's up with all the attack stats? Where are the rare ones? Okay, we got back to back a lot of attack stats, but all of them are common ones. Not going to help out. Alright guys, I guess that's about it for the video guys. If you enjoyed it, give it a like and let's meet again in the next video. Until then guys, have a great day, take care and have a good one. Bye-bye.